lights off now? Sure. Okay. This is made from a five CD um, CD changer. I get a lot of inspiration from taking apart things, finding a part that looks like it would just work perfectly in a new design. Sometimes I'll just find a new parts and that will just change my direction for the next couple days. Just because uh, performance or Here's some pictures of the pickups. That little fudge ball is uh, the steel ball. If you ever rip open a VCR, you're going to see that not only do they transmit one thing over a circle, but they transmit like five different electric charges through a rotating system. I have a lot of concentric proper circles. Uh, I said this could be done with motors, it could be done with lights, it could be done with sound. This is a kind of a corn circuit board, and I welded this. Uh, Kind of like corn um, stock with speakers. You have a little controller on top. You rip open a boombox, take out the speaker, put the speaker wire into the system, and you can move sound. It's like a spatial sampler. Uh, this is just a straightforward, straightforward up down system, but the next one I'm probably going to do is one where the speakers are around you, and you have a circuit board where you can just make a circle of of 80% of the speed of light is where electricity goes, and that's you kind of just DJing inside of a, a sculpture. I brought this fan array today. I've been working way too hard on this, trying to break through to another idea. But what does it really do? Well, if you leave it out in the rain, it barely goes up. Oh, yeah. Isn't that cool? This stuff transmits energy so well that it transmits it to itself. If I turn on the lights and the fan, power is routed to both and there's less power for either. I had a real ideal intention about this. You know, what's it going to do? It's going to be like, wow. <laughs> uh, it's just, you know, it's a principle. That's all it is. Here's what it looked like last night before I welded together that frame. Okay, these are light cores. I put these in New York this summer. It was uh, my center of attention for a while. I made about seven of them. They are resin casted. You put on your metal. <coughs> you hold it in your hand. And wherever your hand goes, light goes. Thank you. 
touching this uh, packed uh, aluminum truck. There's the light squeegee. There's the two different gloves. One's full hand, the other one's less energy go to each individual finger differently. I forgot to bring it, but I also make kind of like pachinko machines where you just drop a um, ball bearing down through a system of welded nails. And every nail's got a light on it, and as it goes, you can see this crazy wiggle path. Closest thing to a fractal light I can make it. Surface sensitizing, just an example of this, how a small space can control large space. It just takes a lot of work. I've done experiments with electrifying, electrifying water, where you have little water, it's very salty water. As you tilt the pole to the left, as you tilt the pole to the right, energy can go to different parts of the system. It's very organic. These are uh, resin casted light wheels. Basically, it's the same principle as this, where it turns, but it's suspended in a bed of water. Everything below the water is energy. The first one I made was the lights are right beside the energy. But these next ones I'll show you, they're set up so that it's just like this fireball as it goes through. The light down here, the energy up down here goes somewhere else. So that as it turns, it goes pop, 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 pop. So there's a lot less boring. Here's a couple more. Okay, well, this is the end of the HTML presentation. Here's a lot of my sculptures in the backyard. Just uh, years of taking the ceramics here more apart. This is my uh, collection of wire. Gone these down, I just keep it until maybe the price is up to about 80 cents a pound again. This is my question of uh, broken junk. <laughs> <laughs> and these are two geodomes that I've made out of. I've, I've scored about like 20 or 30 futons, the Chinese ones. And I just rip them apart, put them back together, make triangles. That one out there on the field is made out of electrical conduit. And uh, one more page that shows you the, the light in the This one right here. Here's the board. Here's the back of it. Here's the pole with the pickups, the principal, the wiring diagram, and the animation. Fun stuff. You can make something and then change the control board. 